It's our final day on the new Bullard's Dam, and we saved the worst for last. We need to get to the hardest to reach area of the dam. Yesterday, we struck out. Because of the extreme curve here, we can't get close enough to the dam face to paint the geo targets. If surveyors can't see them, the dam could be shifting due to seismic activity, and no one would know until it's too late. Plan A didn't work out, so now we're going to plan B. Yesterday, we dropped our ropes all the way to the bottom of the dam. It's a lot of rope, isn't it, Meg? Sure is. Seems like you've been over there for 20 minutes. The weight of the ropes was pulling us away from the dam face. Not math-wise. Lowering less rope might just be the solution. Uh, all right, so what we have to do is haul up the majority of both sets of ropes. Then we can do the lowering from up top from our winches. And then when they're done, we can winch them back up. Matt and Weston are going to try using less rope. And if that works, Meg will give it another shot. Hopefully, this problem solving will help us get moving a little bit faster. And so really, yeah, you'll just say up or down. You'll let us know, and we'll get you where you need to go. I think that'll be mucho better. Ooh. Let's go paint. I always thought of myself as the artistic type. That's pretty neat, man. That's crazy. Weston makes a 100-foot drop and manages to pull himself close enough to the face to paint another target. Sick. Lowering with less rope seems to be working. But, I mean, we're rocking and rolling. Weston's painting sensor two right now. We're, we're almost there. We're almost there. We finally have it figured out. Now it's Meg's turn to tackle a different part of the dam. The wind is picked up, so that's a new challenge she's facing. Okay. I find that if the winds are strong enough, you can just change arms. And like a bird, you could just sort of steer the, the way the wind blows you. Nice. Yeah, there you are. I'm just feeling great. Ready to go for a ride. We lower Meg to one of the remaining targets. She makes contact, no problem. It doesn't look that high when you're looking up. Yeah, but when you're looking down. While Meg is working, Matt and Weston finish off the rest of the targets in that deep center part of the dam that gave us so much trouble yesterday. Now for you, but if you want to come in over here, pull you in some and your ropes through there. Good looks. Meg's on a roll too. She's just about wrapped up with her targets as well. We have the power now. Drask, Eric, can I get a copy? Yeah, I got a copy. Thanks. There you go. Yeah. We're having a blast. Everybody's back on the ground safely. Job's almost done. 